This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello there, I'm Virginia Chow with this ABC 10 News update. Cal OSHA has extended workplace COVID-19 safety regulations into the next year, this time for both unvaccinated and vaccinated employees. Under these new rules, if vaccinated workers are exposed to COVID, they will be required to wear a mask and stay six feet away from others at work for two weeks or stay home. The revised rules will be in effect from January 14th through April 14th. San Diego State has announced a new COVID policy. The university will now require all eligible residential students and student athletes to get booster shots. Those who don't must show proof of a negative test every seven days. Certain exemptions will still be accepted. That new policy goes into effect January 18th. Firefighters, lifeguards, and ice skaters took part in the annual Light the Way event at Rady Children's Hospital. Patients and staff got to enjoy the light parade courtesy of San Diego Fire Rescue and San Diego Lifeguards last night. Sponsors and fundraisers also gathered at the Rady Children's Ice Rink at Liberty Station for an evening of skating and music. The County of San Diego lit up the County Administration Building with the Rady colors to show support for the event and the children. Let's see what the weather holds for us on this Friday. What's going on, Vanessa? Yeah, we finally made it to the end of the work in the school week. Conditions outside are absolutely gorgeous and will remain gorgeous as we progress through your weekend. Satellite and radar composite showing that we're no longer seeing any isolated showers like we did this morning. A lot of us are just seeing plenty of clearing and a lot of sunny skies. Let's go ahead and take a look at those highs this afternoon. We'll top out in the mid 60s along the coastal communities. We'll be about five degrees warmer as well through those inland areas, mountains, plenty of sunshine with the exception of gusty winds. We'll see them ramped up near 30 to 40 miles per hour at times along those western slopes and some of those inland valley neighborhoods as well. Meanwhile, the deserts close to 70 degrees with plenty of sunshine. As we roll out that seven day forecast, we remain pleasant through the entire weekend and then things shift looking ahead to Tuesday evening through Thursday. That's when we have onshore flow making a return and we'll likely see some rain happening Thursday through Christmas, possibly Virginia. Thank you, Vanessa. For the latest news, weather and traffic, just go to 10news.com or you can download our free app from your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Virginia Shaw.